Hey guys, welcome back to Misha's Corner. Today I'm going to show you how to boil eggs. <laughs> I get this request like a lot on my Instagram. So I'm going to show you how I do it and how it works for me. I actually do it three different ways, but this one is a fail proof way. And if you mess this up, then you don't need to be eating eggs. <laughs> So, um, yeah, so make sure, first of all, your eggs need to be room temperature or slightly chilled. No more than that. If your eggs are frozen or really, really cold, this is not going to work. So now you're going to fill your pot up with some cold water, and I'm going to put the eggs in, and I'll show you what I do from there. So I have my eggs in cooled faucet water. Now I'm going to put it on the stove. As soon as you see it starting to boil, turn your stove off and cover it. I am going to show you that step, but I want to tell you all ahead of time. So as soon as it starts to boil, don't even let it boil for seconds or minutes. As soon as the bubbles start to form, turn it off. This is the point where I turn my stove off and then I'm going to cover it and let it cook for 10 minutes in the hot water. Now to the next step, we're going to saute some mushrooms. You need three simple ingredients. I'm using some baby bell mushrooms, some butter and some thyme. Um, as I told y'all before, mushrooms love thyme. So if you haven't tried that before, <laughs> make sure you try it because it's really, really good and simple. I got my mushrooms cooking up in some butter. I'm going to add my pepper and my salt. And then in the last minute, I'm going to start adding the thyme in. And then that's it. Pretty simple. Mm -mm -mm. These cooked up so, so good. They're super, super good. <laughs> I'm going to plate it all up. And I'm going to show you what I do with the eggs next. So my eggs are done. I have them sitting in cool faucet water just for five minutes so they could slowly cool down. And then I'm going to peel them up and show y'all what the insides look like. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Perfect every time. No dark circles, no dark marks. It's not undercooked. It's not overcooked. Just right. <laughs> But I like my eggs hard boiled, so this is what works for me. But if you like your eggs like soft or whatever, you could cut your time in half and that'll work. So, but this is how I like my eggs when it's boiled. So, yeah. This is how I um, plated it up. I put some grapefruit here because I have fruit with my breakfast every day. And um, yeah, so again, my subscribers and followers, if you have any other requests, hit me up on Instagram or any of my social media networks, and I'll be sure to come through for y'all. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed my version of how I boil eggs. And yeah, so I'll see you guys next time on my next video. Like, share, subscribe, and I'll see y'all later. Okay, bye.